Well, today is going to be a full day. Yes. In St. Augustine, Florida. We're starting at Old St. Augustine yes. at the Old Jail. Mm -hmm. And there's all kinds of cool stuff in here to see. Yeah. Not just the Old Jail. Yeah. But so, we are going to tour the jail. Yeah. So we'll take you along with us. And uh, hopefully we won't end up... On the chain gang. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got to go through the old jail yeah that was pretty cool, <laughs> it was cool. and uh, it's so many great facts i mean first of all it was an open air jail yeah no windows so glass. whatever elements in in florida come in bugs critters which aren't good elements no i mean rain heat the humidity uh the women prisoners spent what 12 to 16 hours a day cooking, cooking. and cleaning yeah and the male prisoners were out on the chain gang yeah. 12 to 16 hours a day you got one bath a month. a month that's that's just cool <laughs> and it wasn't even really a bath no because they fill up one tub of warm water and 72 to 110 male prisoners go through the same, same tub. tub so if you're number 72 or 110 depending on what the population was if you're toward the end i mean it's even if you're second it's still gross <laughs> because the first dude hasn't bathed in a month you get 70 dudes that haven't bathed in a month oh yeah and then after the guys get done it's the ladies turn yeah there was uh, there was no oh. ladies first back in the <laughs> day <laughs> apparently yeah and another cool thing is this place operated until 1953 yeah i would have never thought it's so crazy yeah. there is only how many cells 14 was it did he say 14? 14 somewhere in the teens, teens. number of cells teens. and you do the number of let's say 14 or 15 cells 72, 72 to 110 divided by 14 <laughs> there's only four beds in each cell yeah so unless you're the tough guy <laughs> one of the top four <laughs> tough guys you just leave it on the ground or you're or with another dude the little spoon yeah <laughs> <laughs> Nobody wants to be the little spoon. No. <laughs> Not in prison anyway. <laughs> anyway, really cool place. Couldn't film a, a whole lot while we were in there because it was a guided tour. And uh but it was just it's really cool. Yeah. It was fun. Gotta see if you come to St. Augustine. Yeah. Alright, we're getting ready to go inside of the Pirate and Treasure Museum. Yes. Scurvy. <laughs> um supposedly there's a lot of like for legit real pirate right. stuff. Yeah. So it has like um, old pirate weapons, maps, history, yeah, all that cool stuff. So, um, Great. but what I will be looking for is your booty. <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> Go see if we can find Leslie's booty. <laughs> oh Lord, nobody wants that. <laughs>
What did you think about the uh, Pirate and Treasure Museum? Very interesting. Very cool. Um, a lot of stuff that I didn't really expect. I mean, I knew there would be like real stuff. Yeah. But some stuff like one of only two pirate flags that are still, still in existence. Remain. The only treasure chest. Yeah. Still around. Yeah, and then there's like um, there's maps, like real maps, real ammo, um, like um, charter logs. Yeah. From when they sailed and where they went. Uh, crew crew people yeah. list manifest kind of yeah. things and stuff. It's pretty cool. You got to touch a 400 year old chest. Yeah. I don't think it was a treasure chest because there's only one existence. It's, so yeah. it's some kind of chest, chest though. Yeah. And then um, there was the the oldest wanted poster. Yeah. World's oldest yeah. wanted poster yeah. still in existence is in there. And then a bunch of cool little props uh, that were actually used in pirate movies. In movies. Yeah, original yeah. stuff from the movies. So the old Chester Copper Pot from uh, the Goonies. <laughs> Goonies. You got like, the sword from the Pirates of the Caribbean, the hook from Hook. hook. Yeah. Um, some of the outfits and stuff. Just really cool stuff. Yeah. Leslie is about to partake in the Fountain of Youth. <laughs> Let's see if it instantly turns her younger. <laughs> wow. I wish. Interesting. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> like, interesting doesn't seem good. You have to try it. <laughs> Seems dirty down there. Yeah. Yeah, see. See what I say? I was kind of expecting it to be colder. <laughs> and less like feet. <laughs> This is the Indian burial ground yeah. at the Fountain of Youth. Yes. One of America's first burial grounds. Yes. Now they used to be on display. Mm-hmm. Creepy. Which would be really cool to see. Yeah. Uh, and so now they're just a few feet under the surface that you saw that we just filmed. So you can't see anything now because in 1991 they basically had like a... A reburial. Yeah. Service. Catholic service. Yeah, it was kind of like a funeral for all of them, and yeah. then they just reburied them. So they're not very deep, but they're preserved in there, so you can't really see anything in there, no headstones or anything, but they're there. They're right under the surface. We'll do an overlay and, and show you what it used to look like. Yeah. There's a placard on this monument, but we will save you the time of having to read it. 
and let you know that this is the spot where Ponce de Leon first landed in 1513 and named this spot Florida. <laughs> so if you love the name Florida, <laughs> thank you Ponce de Leon. <laughs>